Hey there friends, how's it going? Stardew Valley, the game about starting your own little farm, interacting with the community, but I've chosen to never leave my farm for some reason. This is year three, where I never leave my farm, other than going in once a year after spending a year trying to make money without leaving. I want to make 70,000 gold without leaving the farm. I have some items in mind I want, but I'm sure I'll come up with some more along the way. As always, it takes its twists and turns, but without further ado, let's dive right in. Okay, so this is my haul for my brave excursion into town. First thing on the agenda, as a true Irishman, I bought hundreds of potatoes that I really need to get to work on. I want to make some sprinklers, as you can see here. I've got some iron from the store, but I want to make good ones since my resources are limited, so I need a recycling machine. For that, I need to use my limited coal. I also bought this coop hoping that I could get chickens, and then I forgot it takes a while to build it, so I couldn't get any chickens. And I built it right outside my house, so every morning I wake up, I'll see my failure. Okay, recycling machine, I need stone and iron bar. Iron bar's in the works, let's get stoned. Ah, a present from the sea. What's in this for me? Bodily retaining so well, I, I don't really need it, but thanks, see? It's a lot more than anyone in town has ever given me. There we go, there's the iron, and then I should be able to make my recycling machine. Put that right next to my mailbox. Hopefully he'll accidentally put the bills in there. <laughs> They'll just get recycled immediately. Okay, and now I can put trash into the recycling machine. And I believe it makes me quartz. I've got some orange saplings to plant as well, so I'll throw them down. Ah, it gave me iron. Okay, well, that's still good, <laughs> but that's not quartz. Ah, I see. So you need a broken CD or broken glasses to get refined quartz. And what's the best way to get those? Can I get them from fishing? Yes, I can. Okay, the fishing begins. <laughs> Oh, no, not there. I don't think I'm gonna get any there. <laughs> but you know what? I can still get like bits of iron and whatnot from trash. So it's all good. It works out. Sell my syrups and stuff from the tree. <gasps> Wait! Oh my god! Past Kevin's a genius! He's been storing them! <laughs> I thought I was an idiot and I sold them because I'm so used to, well, being an idiot. Oh my god, I'm rich, baby! I got 16 broken pairs of glasses! <laughs> Oh, it's gonna be a long day of standing next to the recycling machine, isn't it? Gonna move my one and only friend on the farm. There we go. You get a new view for the entire year. Oh, look at that refined quartz. It didn't even take that long. All right, let's get to work. Wait a second. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't have enough farming to actually make the sprinklers. I only need to get it up a level though, so I guess how many potatoes am I willing to water by hand in the meantime? <laughs> Out of the way, cat, I'm hoeing over here. <laughs> Just because I don't feed you doesn't give you an excuse to be lazy and in the way. <laughs> I might have died, actually. I think he's passed out at the very least. Where's that gift that I was complaining about earlier that now I need and I'm not really gonna acknowledge it? <laughs> I'm just gonna take this quality retaining soil to make it a little bit easier. I think I can make fertilizers well. I've got a lot of sap. Correction, I think I sold or ate all of my sap. Eat purple mushroom. Yes, <laughs> let's hope it makes me forget all of this. All right, now I should have enough energy to water all of these and get some potatoes down. Look at that cat pretending to be crops so he can get water. <laughs> Never! You will get water when you pull your weight on the farm and that means harvesting many potatoes. All right, potato, potato, here we go. Okay, that is a hard first day on the farm. I'm going to bed. Please be raining, please be raining, please be raining. Damn it! <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the one missing. This is cursed. I know it's a minor inconvenience, but I just get bad vibes off this whole start. Even just the fact that it's an Irishman growing potatoes. Like, I, I can feel the plight coming. Oh, must have had a good dream, because I know that happy noise doesn't play when I wake. Oh, wait, it's raining! Okay, happy day! <laughs> Just gonna stand here miserable in the rain, but smiling on the inside, because I don't have to work today. Well, the coop's made, so now I can go in here and look sad in here for a bit, if I want. So that's neat. Okay, I know this is a mistake. I know this is a terrible, terrible idea, but I'm gonna plant more potatoes. The reason being is I think I'll need to plant a lot more to level up and I may as well just get it all out of the way in a few miserable days rather than like moderately miserable days <laughs> over more time. Okay, I'm committing. I'm committing. I already regret kind of starting this. This is, oh, this is gonna take me so long. <laughs> Eight, 
9, 10, 11. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is like 100 potatoes. It doesn't look that bad looking at it, but they are. Oh, I'm going inside and going to sleep. Today is not worth living. It's 10 to 9 a.m. and I'm hitting the hay. What a beautiful day of sunshine, said Hermit through gritted teeth. The sad part is by the time I get all of these harvested and even if I do level up, is it even going to be worth using all my materials making sprinklers when a good half of the crops I've bought have already been harvested? Good thing I have all of these original Beatles recordings to recycle, huh? That's so lucky. And also 15 pairs of John Lennon's glasses. <laughs> right, you know what? This is extremely high octane content, but I'm gonna skip forward until I'm done to save you the pain of this. Okay, I think all my potatoes are ready. It came up a strange sound was heard. The hell is that? <laughs> Did this grow on the tree? I legitimately do not know what this item is. How do I even Google this? Alien pod. <laughs> what do I it's search? Strange sound? <gasps> strange capsule. The strange capsule can be picked up and placed around the farm. It turns into a broken empty capsule after about three days, which enables <gasps> a further Easter egg. It can also turn into a broken empty capsule applied by fairy dust. Once this event happens, once in a save file, it cannot happen again. The strange capsule cannot spawn on the ginger island. Yeah, yeah, yeah. why do I get it? it? Is that it? It's just, just turns into a, an empty capsule and th that's it? I thought I was getting something really cool. <laughs> All right, well, I'll just allow that alien to fester. I'm more concerned with my potential potato crops. I am Irish after all, you know. Potatoes, 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 potatoes. I really hope I level up in farming after this. This is so many potatoes. Come on, come on, come on. Sorry, I'm just potatoing this, to be honest. I need to get this done. Okay, in you go, and uh, I'll hold on to my golden potatoes for now. I also have some sap, and I got some bars as well while I was taking care of the potatoes in the meantime. I imagine you saw a farmer come out, he briefly inspects an alien pod, harvests his potatoes, and then goes to bed. <laughs> yes! Level 6 farming! I can make sprinklers! And look at that! 10 grand from the potatoes as well. The game keeps telling me about this exclamation mark every morning it points to it, because it thinks I don't understand how to play the game. <laughs> I'm just staying here no matter what. Okay, quality sprinkler. How many of these do I want? I mean, it's only gold that's limiting me, pretty much. I think I wanted to make crab pots, but I have extra iron. I don't think I need the gold for anything else, and I have plenty of quartz now. That's what fishing for an entire year will get you. Okay, seems good. Let's make some quality sprinklers. Five of them. I'm pretty happy with that. Sprinklers don't work on this terrain. You you gotta be. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. There's no way. There's no way, right? There's gotta be a spot I can use this, surely. Oh! Oh, grass! I, I just can't get to it, because there's a literal forest in the way. Oh, uh, why does being a loner involve so much work? <laughs> Nothing can go right for a hermit. It's not fair. Okay, can I place one here? I can. Thank God. Wait. I... I can't hold the ground. <laughs> I think I'm gonna cry! What about this ground? Okay, I can do this. <laughs> this is so janky. And when I say I can do this, I can do this tomorrow. I'm exhausted from digging out an entire forest. Foraging level seven, excellent. Oh, I can make wild seeds, excellent. Oh, I need, oh, okay. That's that's a lot <laughs> that I'd need to make those. Okay, but there, there's some for each season, so it's doable. I'm happy with that. It's a way of making use of the sprinklers that I've put way too much effort into making. Tomorrow we're holding the egg festival. Well, you can feck off. You literally addressed a dear hermit. You know me. <laughs> you know I'm not coming. Why do you taunt me like this? Oh, this is reminding me of year one where I just had to keep cutting down trees for money. <laughs> At least I'm not in that situation anymore. I guess. It could be worse. There. One sprinkler down. I'm exhausted, by the way. Absolutely exhausted. This is the most effort that has ever gone into potatoes. Alright, we're 10 a.m. A new record. Better head to bed. At least I have a lot of passive products now that I'm getting rid of, like the honey and the syrups and stuff. Oh, you're moving house. Come with me. <laughs> I'm gonna abandon you in the woods like I've done with my other loved ones before I moved to this farm. Poor grandma didn't stand a chance. Problem is, I use so much energy every morning just knocking trees because I can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> there are also many logs that I just can't break because I don't have a good enough axe. I just have to kind of build around them. It's awful. Okay, another one down. 
The egg festival has begun. Why are you notifying me? They like text me. Hey, hermit, we're all having loads of fun in the town square. Hope your back breaking work to grow potatoes is going well. Okay, got another one down. And since I didn't get any the first day, that brings the average up to one sprinkler a day. <laughs> This is just the worst thing ever. Just passively making bars over here, and I don't mean I'm rapping, I mean I'm, I'm making iron bars and quartz bars, it's great. But I'm also rapping. Yeah! It's Little Hermit in the mix. It's time my food lies. This shit, cause this shit is getting kinda lit. It's a good fit. Like beast of my honey, yeah, get stung, but get a lot of money. I'm sorry, I'll never do that again. Your orange tree wasn't able to grow last night. That's probably cause of the alien, right? <laughs> That's the sentence I didn't envision myself saying when I started this game. There we go. That's all of my sprinklers down and the potatoes planted. <laughs> I really need to clean up the area though as much as I can. Whew, this is hard work. I think it's time to reward myself by eating some sap. Mmm, ignore the face. He really, really likes it. I, I feed it to him all the time. Look at them go. Excellent. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't call it excellent. It's a little bit of a mess, but it's functional, which is about all I can hope for. Aha, yes, wood pat will stop grass or trees from growing. Excellent. I was hoping that. Give me loads of those bad boys. We're gonna place it so that this can't get overgrown anymore. <laughs> this is just the weirdest method. I have strange solutions to things that aren't really problems. I'm just done cutting down trees, okay? I did it for a year and a path all the way out. Hey, get out of the way. <laughs> oh god, I'm talking to trees. <laughs> this isn't going well. Okay, sweet. Now that is just an autonomous farm down there that I just need to check on every now and again. This is not breaking. I'm worried that he's actually going to grow up and I'm going to have to provide child support for this thing. Like, I'm gonna have to raise it. Uh, I'm gonna kill it. <laughs> You know what? If I'm cold, they're cold. Take it inside. It's gonna watch me as I sleep. <laughs> the spreading weeds have caused damage to your farm. What? <laughs> okay, well, this looks fine. I don't really care about the rest of my farm. All right, you know what? I've got some uh, planting and harvesting to do, so I guess I'll just skip forward a bit. Oh, God! The alien's out! Should I warn the townsfolk? You know what? No. Screw them. And they're egg festivals. An explosion was heard in the night. Oh Jesus, what has the alien done? Wait, a meteorite? I think my farm is cursed. Well, I guess it's more blessed than cursed because I get free loot. Now where is that meteorite? I'm surprised it could even land with all this junk all over my farm. Meteorite. Meteorite! <laughs> I found bombs. Who has the upper hand now, meteorite? I'm trying to fight my way through my own farm to find this meteor. It's so overgrown. Oh no. I'm trapped with a stump. I'm gonna have to dig into my potatoes to survive out here. Giving an Irish man a potato is the equivalent to giving Popeye spinach, by the way. Ah, there it is. The exact opposite side that I started from. The path is right there. I went all the way around. Your pickaxe isn't str Oh, they require a gold pickaxe or better to mine. Well, you know what? Then I guess I'll just worship the damn thing. All right, it came from space. I don't have internet out here. I don't know what it is. It's now my god. There we go. I made it a shrine. <laughs> It has its own little path and everything. Hope you like what I've done with the place, by the way. I actually kind of like it. I like the winding path that goes down into the hidden potato grove. But I think I'm going to continue harvesting my potatoes and I will see you next season. Well, that's the end of spring, but I made some good money on the potatoes. I did miscalculate a little bit. I have 77 potatoes left over for next year. And I guess I'll leave John the Scarecrow look over him. That's right, I named him John when you were gone because I did didn't have anyone else to talk to. Well, since I have no crops for summer, I think I'll do a little bit of fishing. I haven't done any summertime fishing yet, and especially with a new rod, it should be quite good. I think this was my spot where I could get it in like the, the deepest. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Hooray. <laughs> oh, look at that. And I got some treasure too. A, a fossil. Okay. Should I worry that there might be bodies in the lake? Or is this legitimately a fossil? Oh my god, I'm gonna have so much quartz. Like, it's a good thing, but I want fish. Ah, newspaper. All right, well, I'm catching stuff instantly. Is this because I have bait? Because I don't really want my bait being used to catch a newspaper. Oh, I need the mystery box. Give me the mystery box. 
It's gonna be something worthless, but I just can't resist. A oh, bait? And uh, 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 that, you know what? The weirdo at the museum will appreciate that. I'll take it. I call him a weirdo, yet I'm the one worshipping a meteorite. It's like, oh, hey, Gunther, I found this uh, cool shell. Anyway, I gotta go back. A literal meteor has landed on my farm. Enjoy the shell. Oh my god, that's a slippery one. Ah, he got away. Now I'll never know. That's what I hate. I wish they would show me what I lost out on so I could just, you know, appreciate the disappointment. Instead, I get this boring one. <laughs> you know what? I think I'll just keep fishing and then I'll update you when I have a little bit done. Oh my god, John, I'm so sorry. I just said I'd check in on the farm. Had a few mixed seeds to plant. So yeah, what you been up to? <laughs> yeah, I know the feeling. <laughs> uh, can't live with them, can't live without them. All right, well, I'll talk to you soon, John. But would you look at that? Oranges. I don't know how much they're actually worth, but I should be getting a decent enough haul. You want to know why? Look inside my fish box. They've been in there for weeks. <laughs> but they're like a fine wine. They'll only increase in value. By the way, the slippery ones were the puffer fish. I had a battle with one that lasted about 30 minutes and I lost him. Got plenty of more like glasses and general trash as well, which is good, I guess. Tomorrow we're all gathering at the beach for the annual... <laughs> Leave me recycling my glasses in peace you animal i got some good fish there as well some iridium ones and some new ones that i'm going to save for the community center okay and i can sell all of these or at least i'm going to before thinking about it any longer because i never know what to get rid of or not i need to check in on the mushroom kingdom as well i'm just <laughs> placing these stupid floors everywhere so that i have paths there we go mushroom kingdom is doing well okay i dropped a, a wooden pallet and rather than pick it up i instead dropped more to make it look normal okay let's see how much money we get from from 10 days of work. You know what? Not bad. I, I had hoped for a little bit more from the fish, but that's not too bad. I did use all my bait though, so I don't know how slow it's gonna be now. Hmm, maybe I could make jam. Do I have enough rocks for that? I mean, I could go find rocks, I guess. Oh, great meteor, please provide me with your rocks. Honestly, not sure why I put so much effort into making this. Like, I have a perfectly good trash can here. Why don't I just make the jam in that? Put the orange in. Okay, that looks a little bit worrying. I want to step back. <laughs> Since it is the season of fishing, I may as well make a crab pot. And I guess I'll put that behind here where I'll see it. I assume it can just go anywhere. <laughs> I hope this wasn't a stupid place to put it. Like, I don't know if that's a pond. <laughs> Maybe if there's crabs or lobsters in there, I'm the one that has to stock the lake. Ah, Jesus Christ, I hope John's okay. I'm going inside. Oh, my jam is ready. I wonder how much that sells for. Whatever it is, I should repurpose it as a slime and sell that online. It'll make way more money. I could be the world's first organic local slime farmer. Oh, John's okay, and he has some big juicy melons, like, growing for me. All right, let's pick them up. I haven't encountered any crows yet. That's all you say, John. Whoa, orange jelly 250. I'm gonna make more of those barrels. Honestly, I'm feeling like I don't even have to spam fishing with so much going on here, which is just such a nice feeling. I love not having to repeat the same task over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. Okay, I foraged the farm to try and see if there was anything I could forage so I could make mixed seeds. I don't see anything, but I did make a little path, a good bit around, so that's something. And I have enough stone to make another preserves jar. Excellent day. Halfway through summer, and at this point, I think I'm ready for some passive income. Speaking of passive income, look at that. A cake from mom. Excellent. Right in the trash there. Pick that up. Sell it. Hope he gets me some money. I wish he'd just send me money. Like, love has no value here. <laughs> oh, and just like that, summer is over. No more oranges, and I don't know if I have other trees planted or not. I can't remember. <laughs> I don't think I do. Maybe I do. Who knows? But I still have plenty of oranges to turn into jam. But before we get autumn underway, let's see how much summer actually benefited me. So we got honey, jelly, we got some mushrooms, random assortment of goods here. 
here and let's go right to sleep. You know what? Not bad for very passive money. I think artisan is the way to go. I don't think I can bulk grow crops. Okay, so it's been two weeks and I've just been gathering my jam and whatnot. I think I might make another one of these to try and speed it up a little bit more. Even though I guess I'm not really in a rush. Maybe I should save the stone. I've also been getting a little bit of iron out of some of my other trash in the recycling machine, which is neat. I have this box of goodies that I need to sell. So let's see how much this gets me. Now, this stuff I have been saving for a rainy day. I've been thinking maybe I could drop them into the community center. I could look into it and see what I need, but I have a bit of another plan. I have never done this before, but since they keep berating me and inviting me to their events they know I'm not gonna come to, I'm going to betray the community and invest in the Jojo Mart, which means I don't need products for bundles. I need money, specifically the greenhouse is sticking out to me. I could really use that greenhouse. Reason being is I only visit the town once a year and because of that, I can only buy a certain type of seed, in this case, potato seeds. But if I bought blueberries, they'd grow all year round and keep producing blueberries. It would be an amazing investment. Ah, uh, capitalism, huh? So I've got most of my shopping list ready. I just need to try and earn more money. But luckily that means I can sell pretty much all of this now. So all of this is going bye-bye. I can't wait to see how much money I make today. It better be a lot. The Stardew Valley Fair has begun the town square. You see what I mean? They keep texting me and taunting me. This is why I'm betraying them. I'm putting up this monument just because it's in the box, but it'll be be a reminder to how hateful the people in town can be. Every time I see that, I will be filled with hate. Okay, let's see how much money I got from that fabulous day of selling. Sheesh! <laughs> Over 10k! Nice one! You see those burgers down the bottom, by the way? Found them in the sand on my beach. <laughs> oh, wait. This isn't trash? I thought this was trash. <laughs> I'm trying to recycle cola. Do I have to drink it first? I don't really want to put this toxic stuff in my body. Like, I'm supporting Georgia for the, the capitalist side of things. I don't actually like their products. No, okay, well, I'm selling all of them then. <laughs> the mushrooms have been a nice little steady sort of income that I've been getting as well. I just need to remember to keep getting them. They're so out of sight and out of mind. I do have one thing I need to do. Bomb the meteor! <laughs> it's been leading me astray this whole time. All right, run. That did nothing. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, great meteor. I'm gonna do it again now that I've gotten close. No, it's still not doing anything. I have one left. No. All right, then. I'll go back to worshipping the meteor. Oh, great meteor, etc., etc. Yeah, I, I, I love you. I more than love you. I'm like... In love with you. All right, goodbye. I'm gonna need more sprinklers as well. What was my issue with them? I needed gold, right? But how the hell am I supposed to get gold without going to the mines? The only way I see here is by fishing. <laughs> Our geodes. I've got a few geodes, which is good, I guess. Otherwise, 750 per ore, <laughs> which is ridiculous. This would help me get more treasure, but I need two gold bar to create it in a cruel twist of fate. I'll just put this chest inside. I don't need it anymore. Um, here's fine. I can't read. I don't need the bookcase. The fact honey, like, it sells for a hundred, but it's super passive is really useful as well. What does it take to actually make them? Oh, I need iron. I mean, it's definitely the most accessible bar given the recycling machine. Well, I guess the thing that makes sense is unfortunately fishing. <laughs> I've had more than my share of fishing. I don't want to fish anymore, but I guess this is the situation I've put myself in. I guess I'm hitting two birds with one stone because I'm getting money for the fish which I'm catching pretty good ones with this new rod and I have the chance of getting treasure which is important I might be able to get some gold so I found gold but it turns out if you press E by accident it um it deletes it. But aside from that, I have been doing a lot of fishing. Look, it's nighttime. The hermit doesn't even know what's going on. He's usually asleep about 12 hours ago. But look at all this stuff I have to sell. I've been fishing for so many days. In real life. <laughs> Not in the game. In real life. Look, that's proof. I'm level 8 in fishing now. What is a worm bin? Can I make my own bait? That would be awesome if I could. Because in most of the treasure chests, I have been getting a little bit of bait. But honestly, it it, uh, it is not a very good way of getting it. <laughs> Throw some 
some in there. Ah, it needs a gold bar and hardwood. Okay, well, I'm looking forward to never having that. Notice the chill in the air. It could just be the approach of winter. No, it's probably the meteor and the alien activity I've been having on the farm, and I just haven't told anyone. Okay, let's sell everything in my cell chest and see how much money I actually get. It should be a lot, surely. I put a lot of work into this, and I expect a good reward. Now, this is more like it. Going to bed at 7.30 a.m. <laughs> okay, I, I had hoped to break 10k, but... You know what? Let's just edit that. Yeah, whoa, look, lo loads of money. No, but that's not bad. I'm up to 60,000 already. We're well on our way. Unfortunately, autumn is, well, kind of over. But I'm still getting all these passive things, and I think I should be able to make it. It's gonna be close. Like, even on that day, I got a thousand just from turning in some of the mushrooms and such. Like, they are good money makers. Wait, they're back already? That was, like, two days. I thought that they took much longer than that. Should I be checking that, like, all the time? Oh, I accidentally gave my cat love. <laughs> and it's winter. The month that I usually kind of hibernate through, but I don't have enough money to do that yet. Yeah, I think I should be collecting these every day. I'm going goblin mode. I'm gonna hang out in the cave most of the time. Can I make bombs? I better not say that too loud. It's just this secluded farmer wondering if he could make explosives. I'm taking this opportunity during winter to just build a few paths, so hopefully stuff won't overgrow on it again and I won't have to cut my way through this dense forest. I'm Unfortunately, nothing seems to be washing up. I don't know if it just doesn't wash up on the shores in winter, or perhaps I've angered the meteorite and it's not letting anything show up. So I think I just have to gather mushrooms and my artisan goods, such as the jam, which is running out, and I, I'm guessing bees don't make honey in the winter. Maybe the, the taps on my trees will help. Either way, I will see you soon. Good night. Okay, so it's Christmas Day. I got a letter saying don't forget to bring a gift from my secret friend, <laughs> and I'm not going. I have collected 99 common mushrooms. It turns out you can get mushrooms every single day. However, I was going to keep all the common mushrooms for energy when when I go to the mines on the one day I'm allowed to leave the farm, but I don't think I can stomach 99 mushrooms, so I'm gonna still be an overkill by keeping 20, but I'm gonna sell the rest. I'm very curious how much money this is actually going to get me. <laughs> That's a lot of mushrooms. Honestly, I've been out here collecting like pine tar. I should be after mushrooms. I don't suppose I have any missions that people want mushrooms. No, I know, I don't think so. <laughs> Damn. Oh no, what the hell is happening now? Was that the alien or was it just an owl? <laughs> I'm going to do a little patrolling. Oh, something did wash up. <gasps> there it is! The stoned owl, they call him. Look at him, he's so spaced out. How much would this sell for? <laughs> Okay, so I googled it and you can't actually sell this thing, which is a bit disappointing. Why can't I get random events that I can actually make use of? Okay, it's the last day of winter. I think it's time for bed. <laughs> I'm ready for my trip into town. 73 and a half thousand, that's just over our goal. Look at how lovely the farm looks now, it's so green. I don't know why I went to check on the mushrooms, like time is of the essence and I'm like, uh, just stuck in old habits, I guess. Okay, so my shopping list, I'm gonna betray the town with a 5k a membership to Joja Mart. Buy their greenhouse for 35,000. I need just under 10,000 for 108 blueberries for the greenhouse. I want a shed for 15,000. Four chickens, a treasure tackle from Willy, and then as much ores as I can get, as well as an earth crystal if I really can get lucky. <laughs> I come into town at 7 a.m. and start looking through their trash. Okay, I don't know if this is chancing my arm a little bit, but I'm gonna go straight to the mine and try and just get down to like level five before the stores open so at least I'm doing something worthwhile. I just realized I should have checked to make sure it was a lucky day and if not stayed on the farm an extra day that would have been a good idea. Oh copper lovely I haven't seen this in a year. <laughs> Give me your goodies. <laughs> Damn it no goodies. Yes level five awesome. I think there was a mission for that. Do I get money? No. <laughs> I just get a further mission. It's just a carrot on a string isn't it? Okay I'm already up here so I am going to ask her to build me a shed. Luckily I don't need anything for the shed. 
bed. So once she builds it, I can use it and I can put whatever I want in there. Yeah, just throw it there anyway. What do you mean can't build it? Okay, throw it there. <laughs> that little patch of grass was in the way and she was like, I don't know, chief, there's nothing we can do about it. <laughs> okay, the shed has been purchased. I don't actually even know where Jojo Mart is. I think it's over here somewhere. I never go to it normally. Imagine they see the guy coming in, the fella who grows the local honey and sells jam, investing in this awful corporation. Like, look at this dude. <laughs> Membership costs five grand. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, usually they hand these things out for free in supermarkets and I still say no. Excellent. Welcome to Jojo Corporation. Come back tomorrow. Oh, no. Oh no! <laughs> there you go, Gunther. Sorry, I'm so sad. I was trying to ruin the town, but they won't let me. All right, let's get these geodes open. Give me something good. Come on, Clint. That's right, Clint. Show me that Clint. It may be a dud to you, but I'm happy with copper. <laughs> All right, we got some goodies there that are just going straight to Gunther. <laughs> he must be delighted with himself. Give me rewards. <laughs> a painting, another painting, and a singing stone. Fantastic. Okay, I think I gotta go try and buy some chickens next. Hey, do I, why, no, uh, hold on. When do you work? I love animals. If you treat yours well, I'm sure- I don't have any because you won't feckin' sell them to me. Come over here. Come over here. Come back. Okay, I just googled it. Her shop is closed on Mondays. I hate this town. This is why I'm betraying all of you. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna bend my own rules a little bit and I'm gonna come back tomorrow because otherwise I'm gonna have to sleep for an entire year <laughs> so that I can leave the farm again and I draw the line at punishing myself there. Okay so I've been in town for about seven hours and I would have had about nine left so we're gonna stick to that. I'm also not going to sell any of my stuff so I don't get any unfair advantage and I won't buy the animals either just to, to spite her local business you know. <laughs> she should be open on Mondays okay. Monday is not the weekend. We all hate Mondays. You're no exception. Ah, oh, yes, look at that lovely beacon to capitalism. <laughs> it looks awful. Oh my god. He is basically never seen in town, and the neighbors look out, and he's just staring at the Georgia Mart two hours before it opens. Okay, you know what, Morris? I will take your greenhouse. I love Georgia Mart. You know why? Because you feckin' open. We'll get our workers on it tonight. This is amazing, and it'll be ready by tomorrow. This is efficient business. Thanks. <laughs> it's his cave of a mushroom. Random hermit comes over, emerges from his cave, and gives you a mushroom. What do you do? Probably just politely say thanks and throw it away, right? Oh, look at this. I don't want to be shellfish, but no one else is here, so I guess they're all mine. There we go. Increase my treasure output. Goodbye. See you next year, maybe. I don't know. I might never need to talk to you again. How much does this cost? Oh my god, that is an expensive bag. All right, I'll just take... 108 blueberries from you instead. Where the blueberries? Don't ruin my plans, Pierre. Ah, they are a summer <laughs> crop. Okay. All right, I guess we're growing beans, boys. I'm a bean farmer now. I've never been happier. In fact, you kind of look like Ron grown up. I, it all makes sense now. A bean! I bought a few backups just in case as well. Get out of the way! <laughs> My time here is limited. All right, bro, I know you're about to rip me off, but just give me all your gold, okay? This is, oh, this feels awful, like so bad. <laughs> okay, I can stay here for about four hours and then I'd be headed home, I'd say. So I need to try and get as far down as I can. Dude, please get out of the way. I honestly have no time for you. <laughs> okay, good. He's stupid. He's stuck on the rocks. Ah, ah, I'm stuck on the rocks. Oh, a prize. Shoes. That's kind of neat. I don't really spend much time on my feet, though. I'm usually just in bed. No. No, get out of the way. I don't want to fight. Oh, oh, uh, Jojo Mart, send help. <laughs> My one ally. Oh, I best be going. I don't have much time to get home. Well, that was a bit of a bust. I got some copper, which is good because I think I need them to make a mayonnaise machine, which now that I think about it, doesn't matter because Marnie doesn't open on Mondays. <laughs> That's what I needed the earth crystal for too, so... I guess that part doesn't matter either. I hate Marnie. Oh, there's Robin. Look at her. Just hammering that one post. You want to see what efficiency looks like, Robin? Yeah. Overnight and everything. Look, the foreman's even there. The big man. Keeping an eye on both of them, I see, with his shifty eyes. I don't like that Miner's treat is like a, a lollipop, you know? It sounds like Miner is in like, you're, you're baiting Miners. You know what? Okay. Hey, who are you? Good morning. <laughs> She's probably like, you ruined the town. It was a lovely walk out here. I haven't seen this old farm in a long time. It looks even better than I remember. Stop lying, Evelyn. I brought you a little something. It's a gift from one gardener to another. What the shit is this? 
that? Garden pot. Crops of any season indoors. I don't need your small town help. I have a greenhouse. Oh my god, you make them with refined quartz. <laughs> my shed just got a whole new purpose. Look at that monstrosity. Let me over there. <laughs> the, the farm is so overgrown already. I guess it's good. It looks like I'm just a humble farmer, but in reality, Jojo Man hooked me up with this greenhouse out of sight. Look at this. I can plant beans all year round in here. These take a long time to do, so if you enjoyed, drop a like. I'd appreciate it. Subscribe if you're new, and I hope to see you all next time. Bye for now.